So from that place of understanding, give us your keys to victory for both men, starting off with Ugas. I got keys for both Let's guys. Starting with Ugas, he's got he's the taller ranger guy. Use that jab. Try to control Manny Pacquiao with the jab. He's got a good jab. As long as he uses it, he will be able to be effective. This is the most important weapon, best weapon that your Dennis Ugas had. He's a ripper to the body. He can get to Manny's body and slow him down. He'll have a, a very good chance of beating Manny. And then the most important key right here, make Manny fight. In order for you to be in this fight, your Dennis Ugas, you have to force Manny into that firefight and try to catch him slipping. And like that right there, put Manny on the canvas. And then, of course, we have Manny's kick, uh, v, uh, keys to victory. His speed and his quickness, uh, Keith, you know better than anyone. That speed, not only with his hands, but also with his feet. He gets guys out of position, and then he capitalizes almost every time. It's, um, it's really amazing to see Manny use speed with, and quickness with both hands and feet. And the, his best weapon is his straight left hand. He always sets that straight left hands up, hand up by getting that angle. He can set that left hand up and get your Dennis Ugas out of there early. And more importantly than anything, Manny Pacquiao, you're 42. You got to finish strong. He, he takes his foot off the gas pedal. And if he does that against your Dennis Ugas, your Dennis is a guy who can be strong all the way until the end. If Manny takes his foot off the gas pedal, it could be trouble for Manny.